What is up everyone and welcome back to ANR Gaming. This week we are going to be doing another Genshin Impact video for you guys. We're going to be doing a step-by-step -step guide on how to get to the Hidden Treasure Pirate Ship. So this one is a goodie that we found and it is filled with a whole bunch of treasure for you guys. So you do not want to miss out. So first of all, you can get to uh, this area from the teleport that is on the back island over there. Or you can get to it from the domain teleport on the big island. Um, the domain teleport is more conveniently located because the big island is where we are going to need to be to take our flight off of to get to the pirate ship. So once you are there, this is from the domain portal as I mentioned. You're going to be going ahead and taking a sharp right from there. And we're just going to go ahead and get our first view of the pirate ship. Now the pirate ship does not show up on the map at all. And the only way to see it is if you're on the back end of this island, which is where we are currently. So as you can see, it's right back there. And as you can see, I also have a few quests that I'm going to be turning in there. Because once you are there, not only is there a treasure chest, but there's also a few quest lines that you get to do. So once you are on this big island over here, you're going to be looking for the tallest peak on this island. You can see it from anywhere on the island, and that's where we need to get to. So, you don't need to climb all the way up to the top because it is a far climb up to the very tippy top of this thing. Luckily, we only need to take off about halfway up the cliff or so. And uh, be warned, there are a couple of different attack mobs here. So, you can avoid them if you uh, ride the outskirts as I did right here. And then you just want to go ahead and take right off. Now, depending if you uh, you know have a low stamina versus high stamina, depending on your AR and everything like that, um, you know you'll either get very close to the ship or you'll be able to land right on the ship. So once you do that, you'll be good. And uh, also, don't forget to check out all of our other video guides for all these other quests that we're doing right now. Um, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you are enjoying this video so far. It really, really helps out, and it means a lot. Thank you, guys. But once you're there, this is where you're going to want to do your first thing, which is you're going to want to climb right up the tallest mast on the ship. So we're going to make our way up to the top. You can go ahead and jump climb if you want, because you can take a break in those ridges in the mast. So you can do that. As you can see, I'm regaining my energy. And then you're just going to climb your way back up. If you have any issues with heights, this is going to affect you probably. It affects me. I have an issue with it. We're going to the very tippy top of this thing to get a geo oculi that's hidden up there. And you guys will always want to make sure you are getting those oculi whenever you see them because you're going to have to get them all eventually. So make sure that you do that and just take the time. So once you guys are up there, you're going to go ahead and ride the way the rest of the way up through this little needle thin wooden plank right here or I should say wooden pole rather and then right there is the geo oculi so go ahead and grab that and then from there we are going to fly down to the shortest mast and there's the crow nest in there there is a treasure chest this is going to be the Lux treasure chest so this is going to be the really good chest that we want. So go ahead and aim carefully because you don't want to have to climb your way back up and then open that one up. Get all of those goodies that come out of it. A sword fell on the ground. I just realized that now. That's not great. I don't think I managed to pick that one up in time. And then just go ahead and land back to center on the ship. And then we're gonna go pick up the rest of the treasure that we have. So if you just go to the back of the ship, you're going to find three more treasure chests. There's gonna be two commons and then one exquisite, I believe. So you just wanna go ahead and open those up. I don't know why my character, I don't know what I was thinking at the time, my character leaves for a little bit. I will end up coming back and opening them. But um, that's pretty much what you have to do. As I said, there are also a few quest lines here that you can take care of. They're very, very simple. It's really just a, um, you know, take this and go here 
kind of situation but you will have to go you have to go off the island and then go back onto the island so make sure that you remember the pathing that you took in order to get back here just remember this or you can always come back to the video if you want but that is pretty much going to do it for this video guys thank you all so much for tuning in make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video leave comments if there's something there that you found um, on the ship that I, I somehow did not pick up but that's all good and make sure to check out these other videos that we have going on guys because there's a bunch of other videos that we're trying to do for a bunch of other quests and uh, we're setting up for the new 1.1 patch that's going to be coming out uh, we have a couple people that are going to be doing all of that day one all of the new content so thank you all so much and we will catch you next time game on